We used to have each other's playlists. No, no. We used to be each other's best friends. Yeah. What's up YouTube? It's Kira here. We're back with another video. If you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Kira Gray, and if you're returning, then welcome back. It's my first day of school, guys. Woo! It is currently at 7, almost 7.45, and first class is dance. Why did I sign up for dance at 8 in the morning? I don't know. But I am really excited. Um, the teacher dances with a company here in um, the city and it's a company that I've actually like looked up to for a really long time. So I'm very excited to be uh, training with her and, um, and getting to uh, move, experience the movement um, that she brings forth because I'm sure it'll be kind of similar to how the company moves which is why I look up to the company because like I just love their movement. So. I don't know if that makes sense, but yeah, it's, I'm just really excited. I'm experiencing a bit of knee pain this morning, which I really don't like because my knee gives me issues a lot when I'm dancing. That's what that's kind of one of the things that scares me when it comes to like if I'm gonna dance professionally or not. Um, and it started hurting after I broke my foot like in 2021 so we just gonna pray for that we gonna pray for that it's 9 49 7 child girl it's 7 49 i'm just gonna chill out for a little bit um class actually starts at 8 40 so i'm gonna walk over at maybe like 8 10 8 15 ish because i know the room number but i've actually never been into the building where the dance class is so i just want to make sure that like i don't end up in the wrong place because this campus is low-key very confusing Thing. So yeah, we're gonna figure that out. I'm gonna throw some music on, take you guys with me in that. I don't know if I'll be able to record dance class, but I'll definitely for sure check in with you guys um, and let you guys know how that went. Y'all, <laughs> bro, <laughs> let me tell y'all about this class. Hold on, let, let me just set y'all up for a second. Wow, y'all, class was so great. It was so good when i tell you guys i have not taken a class like that in such a long time like the last time i took a class like this was probably like it well it was the master class it was a um, kyle over here master class but um oh my gosh i just i forgot how much i love movement like how much how invigorating it is to get a step like and how much i love being challenged in movement as well taking that class and this is just the first day like taking that one class and just rediscovering like what i'm capable of like how fluid like i'm capable of make my movement and how you know how much space i can take up like oh my gosh there that is a mm, that is a feeling like no other i just i just oh my gosh she was so sweet the teacher was so sweet as well and i was like yes queen like you're so good <laughs> like you're so good it was very hot in there it was extremely hot first of all when i got there i was going up and down up and down trying to find the room and i'm so happy that i left early because y'all i was lost i was so lost and i was gonna record but then i was like girl no you need to just figure out where you're going also i just i'm new i don't want people looking at me like oh why she got this camera with her right now we just gonna wait until i get a little more comfortable in the space but y'all i was so lost and by the end of it i just went into one of the dance administrator's office and i was like girl i was like can you help me find this room because i don't know where i'm going turns out it was in a different building it was in a different building right next to the building that I was in um, and you just walked in and there was a studio it was so hot in there there was like literally no AC and baby I looked down it it was so hot I looked down at one point and my shins were sweating like there were drops of, of sweat dripping down both my shins and I was like I have never I have never experience sweat down my shins before so that was really funny but it was all worth it and i'm like class is at 8 a.m girl but i do not care well it's basically 8 49 but i do not care i'm gonna be up and i'm gonna be in that class because she had us working and i loved it and it was it was amazing so i'm back i need to go fill up my ooh, whoa i need to go fill up my water bottles because the baby 
girl. I ain't got no water in my room. Um, and then I'm gonna go ahead, I think I'm gonna go ahead and shower also. Again, like I said, I don't have class until the evening. Well, not the evening, until the afternoon. And it's 10 16 right now. So I'm gonna just shower chill out maybe review some of my notes and do some readings for one of the for this for one of my other electives and then we just go go to class and see where the day takes us So I was signing up for electives and if you're taking course outside TC then you have to go through this thing called cross-registration. And so I was trying to sign up for this leadership and management of nonprofits course, but they put me into nonprofit financial management. And so I had been in communication with the people and they said I had like access, I was gonna gain access to the coursework two ways two days after they sent that email, but I didn't realize that it was two separate Canvas, student Canvas accounts. So with all that being said, I got into the Canvas account. I see the work for the class, but a lot of the things that were due for the first day of class, which is I didn't do because I didn't have access to the class because I didn't know. So it was like discussions and readings and like a video entry that was due and I didn't do it. And there's a textbook that I actually have to buy. And I'm like, I'm not gonna have that book by tomorrow. I won't have the reading done. And so basically I'm already behind and I don't like that. So I think I'm gonna drop the course because I mean, I'm already, I've already met my credit hours anyway and we're gonna take an accounting class i'm gonna take an accounting class next semester so like i don't really think i need to take this course so yeah i think i'm gonna drop it but i don't know how to drop it and i don't know if i should email <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> they literally went through all this trouble to get me into the course and now i'm like hey i'm gonna drop it because i don't want to take it and i just feel so bad but i don't know if i should email the professor and be like yo i'm gonna drop it or if i can just go into my account and drop it. But the thing is, because it's not the original course, the leadership and nonprofits, management and nonprofits course that I put in my account, this course is not even popping up on my registration dashboard. And so I don't know, <laughs> I don't know how to drop the class and I don't want to take the class. <laughs> this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna wait, or no, Kira, just suck it up. Just send the email. We're just gonna send the email, forget it. I was gonna suggest maybe I should just wait and talk to my program advisor, but no, because this is a different school, through a different school that's a part of Columbia. Let me just be a big girl. Let me just suck it up and be a big girl and be like, I'm sorry for going through all this trouble. La 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 la. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Into this course, but I appreciate all you have done for me. When you add warm regards on there, it's <laughs> like, <laughs> you gotta just add warm regards on there and just make it seem as if, you know, I am so sorry, girl. <laughs> this is like a risky text. <laughs> they just went through so much to get me registered into the course. And so now I'm like, oh, now I feel bad. Oh my God, I sent it. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I feel so bad. Ooh. Oh, she replied. She said, That's TC. You need to get dropped there first. I've added TC here to. Okay. Okay. So it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It is what it is. 
Now PC has to drop me first, and then, and then they'll drop me. Okay, great, great, boom. You know, Kira, things happen, things happen, and sometimes you just can't take a class, so it's fine. <laughs> So I lied on accident. My class is actually at three and not two. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and take these down. That way I actually look presentable for the first day uh, because you know, you know, low key, I'm chill. I'm okay, we're just going out like this, but I'm like, you know what, Kira? It's our day school. Let's just make a nice little, let's look good. <laughs> Let us actually look somewhat decent and good for the first day meeting new people in your program meeting the professor so i'm gonna take my hair down throw on a little outfit and then we're gonna head to class okay y'all this is the fit so we have this shirt on i don't know where i got it from i think it was target i have on my mom jeans i have on my belt and then i have on my dirty white pumas and then this is the hair but yeah this is the fit and i'm loving it i am so so happy so happy that i dyed my hair um but yeah this is the fit i was gonna wear these other pants these like uh baggy blue teal pants that are like so cute but we're gonna save those for a dance class i think just because they're just they just give dance and i don't want to wear them to regular class or they give like night out kind of thing so yeah i'm gonna pack all my stuff up um there are some people in my cohort who i the people that i got um lunch with and a drink with after orientation they are in the library right now so i think i'm gonna meet up with them it's 205 um the building is very confusing teachers college is very confusing so um i'm gonna meet up with them chill out with them for a little bit and then we'll probably just all go to class together to ensure that we um go to the right spot so um i don't know how much footage i'm gonna be able to get but i'm definitely going to try to get some that way you guys can like see the school a little bit more in depth and yeah meet my friends Talking crazy, I need you right in my space But I need it, baby, I'm late But I still can check in with you I know that I need my friends But I wouldn't want to leave You know I wouldn't want to bleed Even my heart, my mind, and my body Okay guys, so I just got out of class um, maybe like 30 minutes ago and I'm gonna update you guys like a little bit more in depth when I get back to my room, but just off of like first impressions, intimidating is to say the least. This program, I already know, is gonna be so demanding and like that was like expected, but at the same time, y'all, these teachers, I'm like, whoo, okay. Definitely gotta be on my ish literally the whole time like otherwise you are going to drown going to drown no like no ifs ands or buts about it so yeah i was sitting with some of my cohort friends we went and sat outside after class and we were just like debriefing and all of us were literally like terrified <laughs> so we love it <laughs> but i'm walking home right now so i'll talk to y'all more when i get back to my room Okay, okay, so now that I'm back in the room, as I was saying outside, the professors are, they are very hardcore, is what I will say, and yeah, if you're not on your P's and Q's, like not on top of it, not ready to engage and ask questions that, um, well, smart questions, um, then you're gonna get run over, <laughs> like you are literally going to get demolished in um in classes because they are like seriously looking for active like participation and just like you know questions that show that you are thinking and conceptualizing everything in a way that um is is deep essentially and um yeah i hope that makes sense but uh, i'm excited i really am I really am excited and um, I think that it's going to be challenging. I think that I'm going to have to tap into new ways of thinking that I have not yet explored. Um, and yeah, it's going to be a ride. It's going to be a ride for sure. But I think that if I ever get into moments where 
I'm like really intimidated or really just nervous about the work that I'm producing. Like the first thought that I'm going to go to and have to go to is God wouldn't bring you here if you weren't going to be okay. It is definitely, I recognize that it is a privilege to be studying at this school. And one, I am trying not to complain that much because it's a privilege and truly a blessing and an honor to be able to study at such a um, just incredible institution. But two, God is not going to send you somewhere that is not going to work out for your good in the end. And so no matter how difficult it gets, like, this is a blessing. This, this is a blessing. And I think it's so easy to complain about things that we've prayed for in the in the past. And so I really want to be mindful of that as I'm going into this next chapter at such a rigorous institution. I don't want to get to a point where it seems as if I'm like never sad, satisfied or always complaining about the new things that God's bringing into my life. Um, so yeah, baby, it's gonna be intense. <laughs> it is going to be intense, but um, I am definitely ready to step up to the plate and just prove to myself that I can do this. Prove to myself that I can do this because I know that I can do this. And yeah, I'm pretty sure, I already know, I'm gonna come out a completely different woman after this and I'm excited and looking forward to that. Um, yeah, but that is, the curls are just, the curls are just curling and I love it. Um, but that is the end of day one. It is 6.38 right now. I'm definitely gonna have to take another shower, y'all, because the girl was outside, she was sweating. Um, <laughs> sweating. Um, and yeah, it's just kinda hot today. Ooh, baby, yeah, back is sweating. Um, so yeah, I, I think I'm going to get a head start on my readings. Hi, I got to be prepared and we have a quiz tomorrow. Um, I'm truthfully debating on if I want this to be a two day coming to class with me kind of thing. If I don't make it a full day, um, in my life tomorrow, then I will for sure get back on here before the video ends and let you guys know how the quiz went and how my first official class went, I guess, because class today was basically just orientation. Um, so yeah, you know what? I'll do that. I will see you guys tomorrow. Let me just do it. I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow um, and check in with you guys at the beginning of the day, going to ballet. Yeah. But I'm gonna just see you guys tomorrow. I'm not gonna explain it. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. It is the next day, September 6th, and we've got new vibes going on this morning. Uh, I just came from ballet, and it was so good. It was so good. It's so funny, because when I was younger, whenever I would enter into a new dance class, new dance environment with people I've never taken class for, I would, use that as an excuse to become very shy and not talk to anyone and be very intimidated by everyone in the room. But mm -mm, I'm at a point where I have grown out of that and just to see and recognize my growth um, as, I enter new, as I enter into new spaces, like it is just, sorry, I'm messing with this sticky note. Um, it, is, it is really, um, it makes me very proud of myself. Very, very proud of myself. Yeah, um, class was really great at 8 40 again in the mornings and he was like just letting you know it's gonna get rougher from here and i was like bet okay let's do it um so yeah that was really great there's an audition happening tonight with roger george and i like literally he's i love this man he's so great but and it's open to all like columbia barnard students but if you like get cast in the piece and you have to enroll for credit hours and literally each credit hour is like thousand dollars and I just I can't afford to enroll in it but I think I still am going to show up to the audition and one just say hi to Roderick but two like maybe just take it as a class um I don't really know I'm gonna talk to him see see what happens but yeah I definitely want to make sure I put myself in the room with him though because Roderick George man we go way back we go back to high school and um because he was my teacher and he's just oh he's just so great and I miss him so yeah, I'll check in and let you guys know how that goes at the end of the day. It's 10.37 and I'm about to go meet up with um, one of my friends, Dylan, to just like go over notes, study, and drink some coffee. So, yeah, we have a quiz this afternoon.
so excited for that. <laughs> yeah, I'll just check in with you guys later. Like I said yesterday, today's today's video is not going to be as more in-depth. It's just going to be like more just check in after each significant event that happens. Because um, y'all saw a full day yesterday and I ain't really going to be doing much but studying today. So yeah, I'll just check in with you guys after class and let you guys know how that goes. Okay guys, this is my last official weird choppy flip jump around in the vlog. Um, I'm finally about to make sure this recording. I'm finally about to sign out for the night, but um, I took the quiz and it was fine. It was, it was literally like, it was so easy. <laughs> um, we were all literally so worried for nothing, uh, but I have a feeling that they're going to get harder as the semester goes on. But I, yeah, it was simple. Aced it. Um, yeah. I walked out of there and I was like, Kira, you were tripping for nothing, but you know, now I know the format. I know what she's gonna cover and like how the quizzes are gonna be structured. So that's really cool. Um, I decided to go to the audition. I think I talked about that. But yeah, I took the class and it was, oh my gosh, it was, it was so good. It was so, so good. It just so, just so, uh, what's the word? Just fruitful and, and just, amazing he was like i told him before we even walked in i was like just letting you know like i wonder if i can i just take this as a class because i ain't got the money to do it for credit hours and then by the end of the audition he was like we're gonna work it out and so i was like yes um so yeah i there's no way i can't be in his piece y'all it was so good it was so good and you know we gonna work it out. God gonna work it out. Yeah, but that's that. I am sweaty. I am stinky. I am tired, and I'm gonna sleep so good tonight. I already know. Ooh, nine ten. I'm gonna be in a bit by ten. I'm being a bit by ten. I ain't gonna do no work tonight. We just go to bed because I still have one more dance class tomorrow. Um, but yeah, that's the end of my classes for the week. I literally only have class basically Tuesday, Wednesday because my Monday class was every other week. So I really be chilling. So yeah, tomorrow's gonna be nice because I can relax and. Take it easy, you know, sleep a little extra after my ballet class and then get to work. So, yeah, but that's pretty much that. I will check in with you guys on, for our video on Friday. And, yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye.